Welcome to Tech Brothers with Amir. In this video, we are going to learn exporting query results in MySQL Workbench beyond 1000 records. So let's uh, connect to the uh, Workbench. Here I'm connected to the uh, MySQL server. So I have two uh, MySQL server connected. And let me go to the one of the database called uh, Test. Uh, here uh, I have a uh, no, actually, let's uh, forget about the test. I don't have those many records in the test. So I'm going to go to the TBIT database. And here I have employee table. Right click and say select uh, rows uh, limit 1000. You see that uh, what's uh, happening here, it is uh, showing me 1000 records. Um, now, if I will export this, uh, it is going to export whatever it sees on the grid. Um, so whatever sees it uh, here, that's what it is uh, going to export by using uh, from here export record set to the external file. Um, it's not uh, going to export all the records. Um, so if you would like to only export maybe 10 or 20 or 30 records or maybe all of them so you have option here what you need to do first of all you see right here limit of 10 records or limit of 1000 records so let's say if i will run this query limit 50 i can rerun this query it is going to show me only 50 records okay let me expand this one a little bit more and uh, so i can show you all those things and if i want to go ahead and say limit 1000 it's going to show me 1000 records all right if i want to go beyond thousand so i have a limits of uh, ten thousand and fifty thousand um okay great that will do it but there could be a scenario where your table has a hundred thousand records and you would like to export the entire table results or grid results now in that case what you will do uh, you have right here you are going to go to the don't limit so once you click don't limit it's not going to limit anything it's going to show you all the records from your table now you are all set here you can see the query right here so select asterisk from table and there is no limit here so there were total 2000 records that is returned but before that where we were using the limits so it to show you the query uh, with limits so say limit of um, 50,000 or whatever all right so don't uh, limit will ignore everything and show you all the records from the table then you are going to go to the export here and uh, hit us uh, whatever the name of the file maybe export uh, and then provide the um, csv file and see if semicolon separated or json or whatever you want to do it so any file type you can choose from here and export all those grid, grid results uh, to the file okay if you wanna make changes to this uh, query window for a long time, you can always do it. If you go to the edit, you will go to preferences, and here uh, you have a SQL execution. Um, you can always uh, limit rows or uncheck. Um, so if you don't want to limit anything, so you will um, just uncheck it. It will uh, not limit at all. If you want to limit maybe fifty thousand or four thousand or five hundred, even three fifty records, whatever you want to do it, it will uh, use that. Uh, okay, so. We learn now limit 350 records. All right. Thanks very much for watching this video and I will see you guys in next video.